now we'll see some timing diagrams okay so here you see uh, for high speed and full speed operations during a uh, receive time so this is the clock now rx active signal is high okay so rx active signal will only change when there is a change in rx valid okay when there is a change from zero to high in rx valid during that time rx active will change so after that your rx active is rx valid is coming to zero okay this is this is end of packet this is start of packet fine so during that time you see your rx active your rx active, uh, active is not changing okay so rx active when it will change when again rx valid is coming okay what it means see uh, what is rx acti uh, what is the use of rx valid what is the use rx valid will tell that received data is valid data is valid okay rx active what it will tell It has re received UTMI part has received S sync, sync pattern. pattern. Okay, so uh, it has to make a transition should make at that time only. Okay, mm. um, because uh, 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 this uh, uh, timing diagram from this time timing diagram they are trying to say this thing only. Your RX active should not change even your RX uh, va uh, valid is uh, going from high to low. Okay, it should only change when again there is a transition from zero to one. Then only it is changing. Either it is maintaining is uh, previous value, right? But RX, uh, RX valid is low means, right? The received data is not a valid one. Yeah, yeah right, right, right. Uh, then uh, how uh, USB part will uh, take that data? No, USB will not take data during that time. Okay, S okay. see your data is constant; it's not changing. Okay, right. So it is uh, USB is not sampling data here; okay. it is maintaining. Right, I'm right, uh, right. So uh, there is uh, no uh, data transfer will hap happen at this point. Here only see it is changing, right? So here a data will transfer. Okay, right. So this is the objective they are telling. So you we should keep this thing in mind. Now, uh, uh, during uh, reset time, okay, uh, when uh, there is a handshake mechanism between, uh, in order to make, uh, in order to tell a uh, device, in order uh, for host to tell that uh, to device that you should sh uh, sh uh, settle in uh, high speed mode. During that time, we have to uh, count for three kg kg sequences, right? So this is a state machine to detect those things. So initially chip count is zero, fine. So uh, first it will detect k. When uh, not of k will come, it will stay here itself. Now when k will come, it will increment the count. Now count is one, and after that where it will go? It will go here. It will wait for j, right? And it will check whether count is six or not, right? And uh, single ended zero we don't want. After that, when J will come, uh, J will come. It again it will increment. Okay. After incrementing, it will go to K state. So when uh, your count is six, okay. So here uh, it will check count. Uh, see when count is six, okay. So it will go to chirp valid. So that you are having valid chirp. Okay. But uh, hmm. second state uh, detect K right? Detect K. K right. In that state, if you are getting K state. Okay. Then it will go to increment chip count. Right, right, state. right. 